Hi, Rich Karuba for BowlingBall.com. Let's talk to you about a checklist for beginner bowlers. Some steps that, or some keys to fundamentals that will help you uh, now that you're a newcomer to the game and you want to learn uh, a little bit more about how to bowl effectively. Uh, let's get right to it. First, let me give you about 10 different steps. First, when you first set up on the approach in preparation to bowl, Make sure you assume or you get your body in a good athletic posture. By that I mean flex your knees slightly, lean forward from the upper waist, maybe 10 degrees or so, just enough to be in a solid athletic posture. Uh, next, when you're holding your bowling ball, you want to try to bring the ball close to your body and move the bowling ball, the center of the ball, directly in front of your bowling shoulder. This way, when you move the ball forward to begin your swing, you're moving it toward your sighting target on the lane and it gives you a chance to swing the ball in a straight path back to the top of your backswing. Next, make sure also before you take your steps that you flex your knees slightly uh, and also you want to keep uh, that knee flex all the way through your walk to the foul line. In fact, the posture that you get yourself into when you're aiming in your stance position, you can maintain that all the way through your walk to the foul line while you're swinging your bowling ball and when you slide at the foul line, uh, you can hold that same posture while you're releasing, delivering your bowling ball and following through toward your target. Uh, next, you want to make sure that you keep an even tempo of steps as you walk to the foul line. We don't like to see bowlers get too fast with their feet, just like being too slow with your footwork. A good, natural, lively pace of steps uh, will work just fine, uh, and that will keep you uh, it, it, with an organized approach the same amount of time each delivery to make the same arm swing each time for each delivery. Okay, so keep those steps evenly paced all through your approach. Your head and body should be very still uh, and um, as motionless as possible. Try not to make unnecessary movements while you're walking to the foul line. Uh, also begin the movement of your uh, bowling ball into your arm swing, which is also known as the push away. Get that started slightly before you take your first step if you have a four-step bowling approach. Uh, we like to see uh, the bowling ball starting in motion, then your foot follow, and you, and you begin from there. Don't hold your arm, your bowling ball, uh, while your feet catch up. Once that begins moving, keep it moving in a continuous, smooth pace uh, down and back into the top of your backswing. Uh, it's very important to keep the ball moving smoothly, uh, the same pace you're walking to the foul line. Uh, make a, a, try to make a smooth and, and uncontrolled, a free type swing on your backswing all the way up to the top of your swing. Uh, the less amount of arm tension you have while you're bowling, the, the smoother your swing will be and the more consistent your arm swing will be. Um, we like to see the ball get close to shoulder height, uh, a little higher, a little lower, whichever is natural for you at the top of your backswing. Uh, that will give you a chance to have a nice full swing on your forward swing and maintain good velocity when you release your bowling ball. The forward swing should also move uh, uh, downward. Keep your swing close to your body as it falls down from the top of the swing. Let gravity help it fall into the swing. Don't grab the ball and try to hurry your forward swing. Just let it swing smoothly into the downswing and then uh, you can accelerate to a full follow through finish position. If you concentrate on those keys to your checklist, you're going to get your, your game in, good, in a good direction, moving in a good direction. It will help you develop into uh, a successful bowler. Anyway, we hope some of these tips help you. If you have any questions about uh, working on key fundamentals uh, because you're a new bowler, uh, we recommend that you check with a professional bowling instructor, certified coach. Uh, or perhaps even with your pro shop operator locally in your hometown and work on the keys that help, will help you develop your skills as a bowler. Thank you.